this is for uh, Mr. Bass. I totally support uh, your enthusiasm because we have to have business working. When the form kicks in, if they're just bouncing from the form to the freeway, we will whistling this season. So I hope that we will have something that time's passing quickly. Um, maybe you give us a quick update um, on when this site will be finished. And I really appreciate that. Thank you. Good evening, Mayor of City Council. My name is Larry Slings, longtime resident here in the city, first district, and also a business owner in the second district. And I'm a proud resident and business owner here in the city. I love the city of Kingwood. I've been here since. 73 when I came out of the military and I made this my home. And I love the city. I see the direction that the city is going in. I saw where the city was in 73. And yes, we have changed. But life is a change. We're going to change. Nothing will ever stay the same. But now we're at a point where we can become a better city with our leadership, with our, our mayor, our city council, and our staff, we can become a better city. And that's what we're looking for. My biggest dilemma here is that we're always criticizing the leadership. Instead of taking off our, our putting on our gloves and getting in, getting in there and helping our city, we want to criticize them and put them down and talk, talk negative toward them. But I refuse to let that happen. I refuse to let that happen, not only for myself and my family and for our business. It's not going to happen. This city is going to grow. This city is going to become a model city in the South Bay. This is what we want. This is why we voted for the city council members and our mayor. That's why we voted for them, because we want to see the new direction that this particular council is going to put us in. So I'm in support of our City, our mayor and our city council, I want them to do what they were hired to do. And I need the citizens of Inglewood to support them in what needs to be done. Now, if there's a, city, if there's a, a problem, let us, the, the city council members, come out and have a town hall meeting to discuss the things that are they're disapproving. They're let them have that town hall meeting. The mayor had a town hall meeting. He discussed the things about where he wants the city to go. We need to know were you there to support the mayor? Were the city council members there to support the mayor? That's the question. Were they there to support the mayor in the direction that he wants to lead the city? I was there, and some of the members that, I, that are here in the audience were there as well. So I'm here to support the mayor. I'm here to support the city council members. I do have to take my hat off to Mike Stevens and some of the things that he had done Ten seconds. in regards to the soundproofing. Excellent job. Excellent job. But now we need to move forward. We can't talk about what happened in the past. We need to move forward. Uh -huh. I love saying and I approve this message. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay.
do not associate with Mr. Dunn except for business matters, okay? I think she's a fine councilwoman. She's been slandered through and through by this side of the council and staff. And I'm tired of it. Yes, we could have a fine city, but let our councilwoman and Mike Stevens, Council District 1, speak their piece and quit shoving people up when they want to say something. Even last week, you threw someone out who had something to say that was very important. Now, as far as Mr. Teixeira, the statements he made are true. I have seen the videotapes. And what you've done is on there. And if everybody else wants to see those, they're public. Never at the library. Go get them. You can't have those facts. So I just want to say, we have a great councilwoman. And we'd like to keep her. Close from the comments. Down the street. Thank you. 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 Thank you